Now at six, taking a live look over FAMU tonight, where people are heading in large numbers to one of Leon County's busiest COVID-19 testing spots. Good evening, I'm Ava Van Valen. And I'm Channing Frampton. As we head into the new year, we're bringing record-breaking numbers for people testing at Bragg Memorial Stadium for COVID-19. ABC 27's Cara Bailey joins us live from FAMU's campus tonight. Cara, how many people were tested today, and what do site leaders say is causing this rush? Well, Channing, the site just closed at 4 p.m. and shortly thereafter, site leaders confirmed with us that they tested 4,000 people today. They also say that they added more barricades, more traffic cones, and more staffing in order to accommodate the people coming in to get tested after the holiday rush. And you're talking an additional probably 30, 40,000 people that will be here. And so, yes, it will increase the, the testing load on, on the site. Health officials at Bragg Memorial Stadium's COVID-19 testing site are seeing the highest number of testing yet, especially as students from all three colleges and universities return to their respective campuses. We asked all of our students to test prior to returning to campus. Um, we asked them to get test results at least a week prior to and then we're going to ask them to test again in another week. So we're asking students to test every two weeks and our employees also. FAMU student Kiara Broner says she appreciates the university's proactiveness. You know, I actually like the fact that FAMU, they email us to tell us that we do need to get tested often because, you know, as as now, you know, COVID cases are going back up, so it's very important that we are getting tested, especially right before classes start. Students, in addition to people testing from throughout the community, could mean longer wait times and longer lines than the site has seen in months. Uh, start to finish today, it was definitely a lot more students than I expected, uh, but the process was actually fairly easy, um, kind of easier than the past experiences I had in terms of how long it took and how quickly the testing actually took. As numbers nationwide continue to rise and a new strain of the virus makes its way across the state, workers at Bragg Memorial Stadium urge everyone to use the site to get tested for free as often as they see fit. Now, FAMU does say that they have requested even more additional staffing to accommodate the rush, and they plan to open an additional site strictly for FAMU students and staff that will hopefully start next week. Reporting live in Tallahassee, Cara Bailey, ABC 27. Thank you, Cara.